So let's talk a little bit about us, about IT Talent Hub. So we are one of the largest uh, independent community of ITs within the UK, right? We have a lot of things. I'll explain all these things for you. And we have training services and all these mentoring and guiding services running from more than 10 years, specifically in London and other places. And yeah, you can see our office location is also here. And the important is, guys, uh, we we focus too much over the quality and over to your performance. So we have a dedicated recruitment team who will always be there for you to search for jobs and help you at any aspect of your application process. And yeah, and we have a large community of students where a lot of students from different places are together and all your doubts and all will be solved from the expect mentors. So yeah, a lot of mentors are there who are having more than 10 years of experience in specific IT field or training field. So they will be there to solve all your doubts and queries. Uh, these are some of the clients uh, you can say who are hiring from us. Uh, yeah, not too much, but yeah. So yeah, this is one that you will might feel good. So these are you can say one success board where some of the students who got placed in some companies uh, recently, right? Like Akshay is there who got a job in MBP.com. So a lot of them are here, and they all were very beginner. But yeah, we had them at each and every step. So uh, they are there right now. And don't worry, your name will also be very soon over this particular list, and I will be showing your name to the upcoming batch also. Okay, uh, cool. You might be having question that hey Ashish, uh, why uh, like why ID talent have right? Okay, so let me just answer with a lot of things are there, but uh, yeah, we have some time limitations, and also I'll just tell you in a very nutshell, right? So see, we have a lot of trainers who are having a very amazing experience uh, more than 18 20 15 years of experience they are having in the it field also in the training field so they will be helping you and guiding you each and every every aspect of your journey and the curriculum is specifically designed according to the uk job market but in uk the different scenario is there right so your curriculum that you will be studying that is completely designed according to the uh, uk job market and by taking advice from a lot of uh, people who is the jobs and also, uh, we placed more uh, 10 plus students in just last month. That board I shown you. Yeah. And important is we have a, a amazing job program support after training. So we we will not just let you go after training. Hey, your training is done. Now you should go. No, we are there to support you. We have a job support program that is mainly aimed to get you one good job in your hand after your training is done. So I talk about this in detail after some time. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we have some link with top companies, uh, uh, consulting companies in UK, and also you will be uh, getting live project experiences with the startups. Let's say you are done with your training. Now, where you should apply your knowledge. So we have some links with the startups where you can do some live projects. And also, you will be getting interview preparation sessions, uh, CV sessions, and dedicated recruitment team is there who will help you in each and every aspect of your journey. So that's all. Going to the next step, I told you about uh, this job support program, right? So what is included in this entire job support program? So in a very nutshell, uh, each and every support, support regarding to your CV, regarding to your resume writing, right? Or uh, you need some project, a real time project. You wanted to work with some companies. Uh, tomorrow you are having an interview. You need some support. You need, you wanted to just, you need a mentor who can just guide you. Okay, but all things you can study because you are having a very less time. You got one assignment from a company and you need a help to solve that technical assignment. You need one mentorship session or you need some guidance from a mentor. Again, we'll help you. Um, we'll provide you trainings on the very latest technologies and also dedicated personal support is there. That is mainly there so that you can get up and grab a good job that will help you in your career. Uh, yeah, coming to the next point that is important, like how this entire timeline will be there. So. You have to understand one thing, guys, that okay, you will be doing two things. One is your training. After that training, you will be having your life project. So that whatever you learn during your training, you can implement it into the project and you can have uh, your hands on skills. So basically, the training will be happening for two months where you will be getting trained on all the fundamentals of full stack. I tell you which all technologies you will be covering, but yeah, you will be getting trained on from starting from basics, intermediate, and few advanced concepts. You'll be having a robust training in these two months with some small, small projects. Once you are done with training, you'll be having a live project. That will be a big project where you will be implementing all the concepts and technologies um, 
uh, and the technologies that you learned into this particular project and you will be creating this entire project for example if i talk about full stack so this live project will be having the entire front end back end database communication web sockets and all and later you will be deploying them over to the cloud so this is the entire end to end project so that you can brush up your training concepts okay so once this two months of training and one month of live project it means you learn the basics you implemented one project then you will be going under one assessment where we will give you some assessment and if you clear that assessment then you will be moved to the job support service so in order to go to the job support service you should clear this assessment and this assessment will be based upon whatever you did in your training and whatever you did in your project okay once you move to the job support service then what will happen so i'll show you the next step so let's say you i know that all of you will pass the training and live project and assessment also and you will definitely go into the job support service and then these are the steps inside the job support first you will be working on a client project right like one very big project that will be of a specific client set some deadlines and all will be there and you will be working on that project because if you are in a job support it means you know the basics you have created one project you pass the assignment means you are able to do the client projects now so one mentor will be there who will guide you to create this end to end client project okay once you are done with project then you will be uh, applying for jobs not you a team is dedicated recruitment team is there they will look for jobs according to your skills according to what you learn according to your experience and they will uh, get jobs from different resources and that is not your job job it is responsibility of our recruiters after that uh, we will be writing cv for you so there are separate cv writers who are there to write your cvs right so they will prepare the cvs for you according to the different job roles so it's not like we will just give you one cv that hey take it and you are done no for different job roles we'll provide a different kind of cvs so that possibilities can be increased once it is done uh, then they all will collect our team will collect your cvs and they will start applying on the behalf of you right the marketing agent is there they will take the leads from the recruiters and they will take your cvs from the cv writer and they will apply the jobs on the behalf of you so that you don't have to worry you can focus all the time in the preparation and at the last if you got lead that you will definitely get the interview and project set up support will be there from the mentor again so let's say tomorrow you got one interview and you need some sort of support from the mentor so mentor will be there who will guide you uh, to crack that interview so this is all in a very nutshell now one thing that is left right what all things we will be covering in this particular program in this two months of training so what all things we will be covering before moving to that uh, if you have any doubt you can ask me sai any doubts till here any questions for me okay let's okay let's learn then what we will be covering in your training so i'll just use one i'll just use one whiteboard to just explain in a very nutshell right so if you talk about full stack that you you are here that full stack so full stack is mainly combination of three things first is your front end where you will be writing some front end code second is your back end and then database and deployment if you know all these things you are a full stack developer so in the front end we will be starting from a very basic things like we will be starting from html then we will be moving to the css and then basics of js right so you will be learning basics of js and then you will be creating few projects using all these things like html css and basics of js after this we will go to the advanced concepts of js javascript like promises and all and then again you will be creating few projects these all are the small projects like it's not a big project yeah and then you will be learning about react js that is the main thing react js the entire react library you will be learning as well as one front end like maybe tailwind or maybe bootstrap right any one of them you will be learning for the for creating faster ui applications so once you are done with this you will be again creating one major project in the front end so in the front end you will be learning html css basics of javascript then some projects then advanced javascript and then again some projects then react js bootstrap and then again some projects so that you will be done with the front end once it is done we will be coming back to the back end and there you will be learning about mainly node js 
uh, express this we'll be learning about mongodb that is our database right and you will be also learning about sockets you will be learning about webrtc for real time video calling and yeah you will be learning about some of the basic aws services so like ec2 instance or maybe basic services of aws like s3 bucket so in the back end you will be mainly learning about node.js express.js mongodb these are some extra concepts so after learning the front end you will be able to create the good front end applications after learning the back end you will be able to create the robust back end with apis like you will be mainly able to write the back end apis for different things like for authentication for mood fetching movies and all right so these kind of things you will be able to do after that we will create one final project that will be a full stack project where you will be first creating one front end right you will create one dummy front end then you will create the back end apis and then you will connect your front end with your back end and once the entire application is created you will ship this entire application into one cloud service like maybe azure or maybe aws the deployment right so this is the entire course so after covering this entire course you will be having the hands on experience on front end technologies on back end technologies as well as deployment over the cloud that's all and in the back end you will be writing the authentication apis streaming apis and lot of things will be there so in nutshell these are the technologies that you will be learning in this entire training course yeah uh, any questions on this part sai oh okay yeah so coming to the next part these